Hey guys, welcome to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download Amanda the Adventure on PC. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So first thing that we have to do here is we need to open up any browser that you have on your PC. So let's go ahead and open up a Google Chrome here since this is the, uh, the browser that we'll be using today. Now from here, you need to go to a very specific website, which is going to be dreadxp.itch.io. So once you've typed that, just go ahead and press on enter. And from here, you'll be redirected to the DreadXP website. Now, in this case, sometimes the website itself will not load properly. So for it to load properly on your browser, I recommend you to use a VPN. In this case, I'm using Atlas VPN, which provides me 5 gigabyte of data. Now, from here, we could go ahead and just look around their website. And when you scroll down a bit, you should be able to see the Amanda the Adventurer game here. Now, from here, go ahead and click on Amanda the Adventurer. And it's going to load up the web, the web page for Amanda the Adventurer. Now, when you scroll down a bit, you have uh, two options here. So, you have the purchase option for Amanda the Adventurer as well as the download demo for Amanda the Adventurer. Now, in this case, if you want to own the game you could go ahead and buy it for your pc so if you want to try it out go ahead and click on the download demo option here just click on download and your download should now start now once the download is complete you could go ahead and locate this zip file here and from here you could go ahead and double click on your demo and just drag it into your desktop now, once it completes transferring, you could go ahead and open up the folder. Now, in here, let's open up this folder here, and you should be able to see the Amanda the Adventure.exe. So, just click on it and just click on Run. And from there, the game should boot up and you should be able to play the demo. So, if you want to own this game, make sure to support the creators for it, and that should be it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you could use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.